Good morning, THS. Today is Wednesday, April 11th. I'm Faith. And I'm Daniela, and you're watching Viking News. There will be no after-school leaps program tomorrow, April 12th. Sports physicals for next year will be given at Virginia High on Saturday, May 12th from 9 to 10 a.m. Students must have the TSSAA form with the front completed and signed by a parent forms can be picked up in the athletic office or downloaded at www.tssaa.org. The cost is $10 cash. No checks will be accepted. Prom tickets are now on sale in the lunchroom. The cost is $30 a ticket. The after prom party will be at Just Jump from midnight to 3 a.m. Seniors and their dates are invited to attend. You do not have to go to the dance to come to the party. There will be food, fun, t-shirts, and prizes all free. Go online to Just Jump Bristol and fill out the waiver, or you can go pick up a hard copy at the front office. All are welcome to attend the ACT Boot Camp for the Saturday, April 14th, ACT, all this week from 6 to 8 p.m. The camp will not be held on Friday. The Tennessee High School Maroon and White is now recruiting enthusiastic journalists from the 2018 to 2019 year. Any student interested should see Ms. Davis before the end of the day on Thursday, April 12th. Tennessee High School's Mighty Viking Battalion participated in the Appalachia Region ROTC competition at the Science Hill High School on Saturday, winning honors in color guard, first year cadet unarmed drill, personal inspection, and overall results. Tennessee High's color guard, commanded by Jacob McCoy, won first place. Cadet Bradley Carell won first place in academic bowl competition. Tennessee High cadets took second place in personnel inspection and cadet knowledge. First year cadets, commanded by Logan Moore, won third place in an unarmed drill. The Mighty Viking Battalion placed second overall out of seven high school comp in competition. Anyone interested in trying out for the boys golf team needs to sign up by Thursday, April 12th. Sign-ups will be in the Driver's Education Simulator Room 2426. And now we pause for a word from our sponsor, GEICO. So, what do you think? I think savings. Excuse me. Me. Okay. Getting a direct quote isn't as awkward as this commercial. Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. You can register now at ACT.org to sign up for the June 9th ACT and the brand new July 14th ACT. These two tests are the final exams of this academic year, 2019 to 2018. Again, ACT dates are April 14th, June 9th, and July 14th. NHS members, if you have not signed up for a spring service project, please see Ms. Story, Ms. Hartso, or Ms. Strong and sign up for the day of service in May. The talent show will be held on Friday, April 20th. Class night will be held on Friday, May 11th at 7 p.m. Recognition forms are available in the guidance office and should be turned in by April 25th if you want to be recognized for your scholarships and awards. Now here's Drew and McKenzie with your weather forecast and cafe watch. Hi, I'm Drew Fisher with your weather forecast. Today is a high of 61 and a low of 41. Now back to the studio with your cafe watch. But I couldn't increase up and the tread is full. I was so cool. I knew that I couldn't increase them. My friends couldn't afford them. Four stripes on their Adidas. On the court, I wasn't the best. But my kicks were like the pros. Yo, I stick out my tongue so everyone could see that logo. Like the air flight, but bad was so dope. And then my friend Carlos is. In sports news, with the NBA season closing in, the Houston Rockets continue to pull ahead with a six-game lead. Their star player, James Harden, is averaging 30 points this season. Only three players in NBA history have averaged 30 points per, per game on a 65-win team, and they each won MVP that season. Spring wrestling workouts have begun. If you are interested in wrestling, this is a great opportunity to get a head start in a low stress atmosphere. Practice ends at 5 p.m. If you have any questions, contact Coach Marshall. In local news, a man wanted in Scott County, Virginia, has been arrested in Johnson City, Tennessee. 34-year-old Antonio Green was wanted in Scott County for the manufacturing and distribution of drugs. According to the police, Green tried to report a stolen vehicle to the police, and that's when the officers realized he was a wanted Virginian. In national news, after going 15 under this year at the Masters Golf Tournament in Augusta, Georgia, Patrick Reed earns the green jacket. And that's all for Viking News. Have an awesome Wednesday.
was thinking about the fans. We were underground, loading merch in that 12-passenger van.